Dear friends, greetings and good wishes. Human dignity is the foundation of all human rights. So when we abandon efforts to uphold human dignity, we lose the essential meaning of being human. Article 1 of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights states, all human beings are both free and equal in dignity and rights. To be human has specific implications. It entails human self-awareness and actions we take to uphold human dignity. In this age of globalization, recognition of human dignity as the common bond has become more compelling. It demands an unprecedented level of mutual understanding among peoples and nations. Today we face manifold challenges, ending festering disputes that are generating political instabilities, regional tensions, promoting economic and social development, protecting the environment, climate mitigation and adaptation, preservation of, the, of biodiversity, and importantly, ensuring food, water, and energy security for the vast people who live in the developing world. The pandemic has highlighted how important it is when we live in an interdependent world to develop a spirit of caring and sharing. Global refugees are facing a crisis. 70 million refugees have been forced to leave their homes by war and poverty. The climate crisis is making the ecological balance more fragile and disrupting our living environment. Technologies of the fourth industrial revolution are transforming society and reshaping our future. All this requires us to incorporate diversity, inclusion, and equity based on greater solidarity, tolerance, and understanding. The time has come to recognize the value of human dignity for the good of the entire world. And for this, we must rethink human nature and reconceptualize the meaning of the human journey. There is need for a clearer articulation of ethical frameworks to promote a human-centric approach to development based on fairness and justice. Two, we need to develop the collective will to come together in refashioning human consciousness. And finally, we must live with a vision of the future as one of shared destiny. My best wishes for the upcoming 18th annual workshop on transforming humiliation and violent conflict. Thank you very much.